welcome back everybody i appreciate you being here checking out this video and i want to say i'm pretty excited because i didn't know that they're going to throw some vanguard weapons into warzone and so i really didn't notice until i saw the sgg 44 in my assault rifles and then i was, started looking around and i saw the m1 grand as well in the tax um so that's pretty cool i think they're just trying to tease the game you know throw it out there let people try it try to uh you know make them want the game buy the game increase the sales and everything so today i tried those out um and at the end we'll kind of see how it went what i think of them but first let's take a look at the variants that they threw in here and we'll see what they have to offer i have a feeling we're going to make them some special cool variants that way you know they can really pique people's interest so we'll take a look at these right now all right so the M1 Grand that they gave us is over under the tactical rifles. And the variant that they put in here is the White Obsidian, which looks pretty sweet in my opinion. It's got the Vanguard, you know, the B logo on the uh, stock there. And it actually has eight attachments on it, which is pretty interesting to me because I'm wondering if they're gonna let you add more attachments just like you can in Cold War. Um, and maybe they'll eventually let you do it in Warzone, I don't know. Um, but I really like the white color on the stock or I'm sorry on the barrel of this and everything the stocks cool So pretty good looking gun um, But I don't know if it's good or not. So I guess we're gonna find out um, But the attachments that it does have are is the muzzle which is the leopard break the barrel the Cooper 21 inch shrouded the optic is the SVT 40 we're gonna call it the poo scope <laughs> um, the stock is the padded stock we got the bipod under barrel, the cowl down 2X mag, which is big and ugly. <laughs> uh, the rear grip is a stripled grip, and the perk is the on hand perk 2. So, whatever that is. So, they're kind of teasing some of the attachments that they're going to offer, and I guess we'll see how they play out. All right, and the STG 44, which is a real classic, just like the M1 Grand, it was in World War II, you know, the last Call of Duty World War II. And this variant that they threw out there was the Bone Rattler, which pretty cool name. I like it. The barrel is the lightweight short barrel. The optic is the monocular reflector, which has a single blue dot, which I think is pretty cool. I'm going to assume it's going to take a while to unlock that probably. Um, the stock is actually no stock or remove stock. The under barrel is the MK6 Para. The magazine is the extended mag. The rear grip is a fabric rear grip. And the perk is the fast melee perk so it looks pretty cool um once again we'll see how this kind of plays out and we'll throw a load on on load out on there with this and the m1 grand we'll get some gameplay and uh see what it has to offer gas is moving in Throwing frag. Frag. Located. He was downloading your stuff and I got him. Oh, there's three of them up there. Pussy bitch. He called me a pussy bitch. Enemy contact. Thanks, I'm located. Yeah, beat him down, beat him down. He's right below you, mate. Yeah, get him, Rick. Let me have my load out. I'm coming, I'm coming. You broke. <laughs> It has nothing to do with Call of Duty. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna lay down here? Okay. I got the guy that killed you. Oh, no, 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 we're not doing that. Get off of me. 
They're on both sides of the Lodi. <laughs> that was close. Okay, got one back behind over here. Hey everybody, I greatly appreciate you checking out my video. Hit that subscribe button and I hope you have an absolutely wonderful day.